Saturday afternoon at the Alara Center, 7th rank Montana, outlast North Dakota 18-15. Welcome to the Midco Sports Network.com postgame wrap with Ryan Koselski. I'm Dan Hammer. Ryan, the top two defenses in the big sky on display, and it was a defensive dominated football. Oh, it absolutely was. Both these teams lived up to the hype, and you know, I think North Dakota found out tonight that they can play with anybody as long as that defense is playing the way they did. Let's take a look at the highlights from this game, and it was Montana open the scoring. A safety as a bad snap from North Dakota center Colton Bolst to quarterback Joel Mulberg. Zach Wagaman tackles Mulberg in the end zone. Montana led it 2 0. Shea Smith Lacan relieved the injured Jordan Johnson. Found Trayvon Van for the touchdown. Montana led it 8 0 at the half. In the third quarter, Montana adds to its lead. It would build a 15 0 lead on Van's second touchdown of the day. And then North Dakota round mounted a rally. UND put together its best drive of the day, a 10 play, 76 yard drive. They would get this big play. Joel Mulberg to Deb Ferguson covering 43 yards. UND would reach the Montana four yard line and then a turnover. Kyle Norberg would fumble here. Montana would recover and UND's scoring attempt was ended. But UND bounced back another 10 play drive kept off by the Norberg touchdown. UND got within 15 7 on the ensuing Montana possession. Smith Lacan picked off by Chris Brown. A pick six and North Dakota was within a two point conversion of a tie and they would tie the game. Joe Morgan makes a great play here, finding Luke Matthewson for the two-point conversion. Yeah, somehow Joe found a way to elude the tackle here and throw it up, and a, a big two-point conversion. UND's defense got another stop, so UND's offense got the ball back, drove into Montana territory. Reed Tobenheim's field goal attempt for the lead was blocked. It was a low snap, a bad hold, and never had a chance. And then Montana hit a big pass play to Jamal, to Jamal Jones, setting up Dan Sullivan's game-winning field goal. He kicks it through from 35 yards out, and that was the difference. 18-15, the final run of the football, difficult for each team. Look at those rushing. Yeah, and those the defensive line, the linebackers for both teams did a great job tonight, just not allowing teams to run. Bubba Schweigert said a week ago there are no moral victories as he looks at this season, but this certainly would have been such a big step forward had UND actually been able to win the football game. It would have been huge. It absolutely would have. But there are some things you can take from this game and say, you know what, North Dakota did this pretty well, or they did this pretty well. Defensively, obviously, is where you start. But I think offensively, finding ways to go down and score really adds a lot of hope for North Dakota. UND falls to 0-2 in the Big Sky. They're back home again next Saturday, hosting Portland State in a homecoming game, a game you'll see right here on Midco Sports Network. He's Ryan. I'm Dan. That's your MidcoSports.com postgame wrap.